Okay, so here we have a replacement Eccentric adjuster for the new Execute ECQ distributor head. So if you remember correctly on the ECL distributor, these replacement eccentric adjusters came back or came from the factory already wound back. So these springs were already pressurized and you had the two R clips, one here and one here holding the cams in position. Then when you were replacing it and had the machine fully built, you would pull out the two R clips and that will pressurize your blades up against your cutting screen. Whereas for the ECQ distributor head, there's no pressure. They're not already wound back. So you physically have to wind them back yourself or the end user when they get them. So that's just important to note, okay? So firstly, I'm just going to loosen off the two M8 stainless steel bolts, and that will physically give enough room for your two latches to move, okay? First of all, I'm just going to make sure that your four legs are sitting square on the edges. These are the heavier springs, which are more suitable for the Irish conditions. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is go one hole rotation on this cam in the clockwise. And here are the latch that's fully wound back. Then start the opposite side again. One whole revolution. Anti-clockwise, you hear the latch. That's it locked in position. So now you can see it's fully latched there, okay?